Hey everybody, welcome to the community stream. I'm Mortal Emperor. My name is Frothy. You guys know Frothy Elman, Frothy Elman, Frothy Elman, Frothy Elman, Frothy Elman. Tokyo Punch Out, what's up? So if you were at QuakeCon, uh, you will have seen Frothy with us on the Quake Academy. You will have seen him if you were watching our community cast. Fantastic mm -hmm. job, by Thank the way, you. sir. Thank you. And of course, if you didn't catch any of that, number one, why? Number two, uh, be sure you. to check out Frothy's channel on YouTube. Let's let's yeah, we're on, a little yeah, bit. YouTube, Twitch, Twitter, Frothy Omen. You can find me on all those places. YouTube guides, tutorials, trying to help the new guy out. Yeah, Frothy makes some of the Plus. best tutorials. So if you, you are brand new to the game. Um, and we are free to play now, so many of you might be brand new to the game. Yeah. Uh, check out Frothy's tutorials because he has a ton of stuff. He breaks down the characters, you break down the maps, you break down the weapons. You even have a video that I like that is actually like how to be like how to play if you are a new player. Yeah. It's like being yeah. being new to Quake is hard is yeah. the name of the video. Yeah, exactly. And yeah. Don't let that name deter you. It is actually a really in-depth video about yeah. all the stuff you need to know. Yeah, I mean, that was a big thing when I was first starting, is that, like, just learning Quake is, like, this is unlike any other shooter I've ever played. Like, mm -hmm. like all the fundamentals I've learned over decades are just not working here. Like, you need to just reset for a game like Quake. So, yeah, I'm glad that it's been resonating so much. Yeah, yeah. And you can also... Um, we put your videos up on our site as well. So if you check out Quake.com, uh, you can check out the community section. We update that constantly. Check out the videos tab on there, and uh, you'll find videos from Frothy Omen. You'll find videos from a lot of our community creators. Um, we actually have a really great community who makes a lot of tutorials, does mm -hmm. a lot of stuff for yeah. helping out brand They're new everywhere. players. Um, very, very helpful community. So if you're new, welcome to the stream. Uh, I think we should probably tell people. Are you wearing one of the old lav mics? Yeah, this is the I only just really... thing they had left. <laughs> okay, I just so noticed I got, like, that. The... I'm like, wait a second, why is he like I got, like, all the, the like, Sham -Wow. Quake on? I got the ShamWow Sham edition over here. <laughs> oh, so here's what we're going to do today. What you're going to do is you're going to get a towel, you're going to put it out, you're going to put Quake Champions on, it's easy, it's free, it's Quake.com, you download that. Look at look, look at all these games, look at all these games staying in the walls. Boom, ShamWow, <laughs> takes care of them all. Exactly. You got a problem there? Fix it. Boom. Put Quake Champions over it. Easy, your life is good now. So here's the deal. Uh... We just went free to play. Mm -hmm. uh, I literally hold this thing on. Easy. <laughs> we just went free to play, and uh, so yeah, welcome as you guys always do, because you guys are sweethearts. Welcome everybody new to the game. If they have questions and chat and stuff, you know, do the thing that people did for you. Walk them through it. Mm -hmm. Show them the good stuff. Get into some private matches, or just team up with them. You know, spread the love, spread the joy, spread the frags, all that good stuff. So. Here at the community stream, we do all this stuff. We play some games. We have giveaways. We're going to do hats like yes. these beauties right here. Yep. Oh, God, the chair's Ooh. broken. Oh, God, my back's broken. I was, oh, God, my mic's broken. Here so, they are. So the chair yeah, moved and it. the thing it was moved. It was worth it. Yeah, it's just like... Yeah, this whole thing could fall apart. These chairs could fall... I got, I got a computer How's talking to me? Yeah, it's my real that, name, was that, the, was that the hat? I don't know. <laughs> that might have been the hat. Now? New feature of the hat that can talk to you. It knows your first name. Not a problem. Not a problem. Um... See, so yeah, we're doing that. We're going to do some Champions Pack giveaways, which is every champion now and in the future, which, by the way, those are going away in a couple months uh, slash next month. So if you haven't already gotten those and you're interested in diving deep into the game and you want to play it you know, now and forever, mm -hmm. that's definitely the way to do it is grab that uh, when it's still on Steam and on Bethesda Launcher. But uh, oh, also we're going to give away some wait, actually, chests. Quick, yeah, yeah. quick, uh, do you say it's, you're talking about Champions Pack? Mm -hmm. So... That is actually, what's happening is, it isn't going away forever just yet. Yep. Um, it is going to increase in price. So right now, you can get the Champions Pack uh, for $29.99 USD. Uh, on September 4th, that is the day after Labor Day, you are going to, it is going to go up permanently in price to $39.99. So, if you want to be an early adopter, get the price at the best price it's going to be um, until it goes away, which... <clears throat> um, it will. It, it will. Yeah. It Hold will. on, some news just coming in, because yeah. I feel like I always have to do this now that I'm holding my mic. Yeah. Uh, it will. It, it will. Um, you know, it's, it's, it's an incredible offer. You get not only all the champions now, you get all the champions that will ever come out in the future. That's Everybody, I'm gonna be a little friendly with Frothy over Get here. Get in. Get in. Everybody. It also makes me look very d dynamic when I'm just like, yeah. no, you don't understand. That's right. Everybody. Exactly. exactly. Ever. 
Yeah, he's fully so, leaning in. So, the secret. so yeah, listen, listen close. So make sure you pick that up. You also get the custom games um, that you can set up and play with your friends. Make all your own custom rules. You can play against bots. Um, Maggie's laughing over there. And I have no idea what she's laughing. At. Oh, just, I'm sorry. Just reading chat. Yeah, Maggie's not here. Uh, Maggie. Just right off. Another screen, another so don't Maggie. Pay attention completely, to that. completely different. Yeah. We started calling a different Patrick. Different girl named Maggie. We, we, no, we started calling Patrick Maggie because he. he yeah. I mean, he's exactly. just. Exactly. He's just so pretty. Exactly. Yeah. He's just a beautiful. He, he just, he just, he just looks like a man. Get my eyes yeah. off of it, man. Exactly. We love you, Patrick. It's like, let's talk products. We do. We'll wait until after. But, um, <laughs> but yeah, getting yeah. back to to biz here, we just had a thing called QuakeCon that uh, some of you might have Tiny little thing. either been at. Which, if you had, bless. Hopefully, we all hugged and kissed and, and did all those fun things that we do because yeah. we're all fam. And number two, if you didn't, hopefully you watch it on stream because we did Friday. Uh, Maggie, Frothy, mm -hmm. Squeeze, Casmatic, Zep, Vea. Death, Spud, Forty, and probably like two other people I've forgotten because I'm just a terrible person. We're all on doing all day casting for all the group stage stuff for the 2v2 Open for the 175k prize. And it was just, I mean, you tell me, how was it? How was it? Dude, oh my God, how was it doing that stream? Oh, so that whole stream was amazing. It's yeah. like, it's, 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 it's awesome just being like a, a Twitch uh, caster to yeah. begin with it's like I've done tournament casting before but getting on like behind the desk and actually like doing it for real for the first time was yeah. really really cool it was scary for the first like 30 seconds yeah and then you just kind of just, just smooth right and it's like I've done this before I know what I'm doing and it was it was a blast I had a lot of fun That's awesome. I was really excited to get back later on that night yeah yeah, yeah it was really cool and like again if anybody hasn't watched it you can either go to twitch and watch mm -hmm. the VOD there's a playlist or you can even do uh, for YouTube uh, for Quake Champions uh, yes. easy to watch fun to have and leave comments. That's the weirdest thing about mm -hmm. Twitch is you can go back to an old VOD and leave comments like you're in the stream still doing it. Yeah. So just keep it fresh. Keep it weird. Just keep adding stuff to it. Um, yeah, Jason uh, Hindley97 uh, from Mixer. We can see we what can you We can see what you type. We can see we are, what you type. We are watching. So, you know. I said Be before, aware. community managers, <laughs> we see everything. That's right. We, but, are, we are on the ball. With yeah, that. we're omnipresent. <clears throat> But uh, speaking of presence, let's cut to the <laughs> desktop uh, of the PC we're going to be playing with you guys in a little bit and just walk through a little photo gallery of just some things we wanted to highlight that we saw that were kind of uh, amazing. So first up, you can see this right here. This happens to be a gauntlet. Um, you might be recognizing it from Quake 3, also now in Quake Champions as the Pummel. So these guys, at Paul and his team at Chronicle Collectibles, who also are doing the Fallout 76 helmet, the... Ones that I'm sure if you don't have, you're like, how the F do I get that? This isn't the stream for that, but they made these amazing pummel trophies, of which I'll show you a few shots of. Oh, who do we have here? Is that Zeron and Avic just being boys, having times, just hanging out during the matches, talking smack? Who knows? What's that conversation like? Let's cut in closer. Oh, look oh. at this. We got eSports. We got Team Liquid. They're doing it. That's, the, that's one of those. Uh, you got the Shane fist pump. You got the yell. Was that the... Was Tim that is a... Uh, was He's that the one more focused. game right there where he was like, yeah. it's like one more game. Like. Yeah, I like to, even if it isn't, I like to just add, which is, you know, yeah. we're, we can basically say whatever we want now with the subtitlers. So Tim is going, that was a pretty good shot. And, and, and Shane is saying, no, shush, one more game. <laughs> Esports. Look at that. That's what friendship looks yeah. like, by the way, if you guys are curious. And that's Tim being like, oh, they're taking pictures of he's our like, he's, like, oh, he's, no. like, he's like, I got to look at it again. <laughs> I got to look at it one more time. <laughs> exactly. And then that's the two of them smiling. And I, I wanted to, if I was uh, there at the time, I would have been like, hey, Shane, you got a $60,000 check in your hand and you're holding a pummel. He's, he's, Let me see your teeth. Smile, he's boy. He's so serious. He's so serious, though. He's all biz. Yeah. He's winning. He's doing it. So congrats to Team Liquid for pulling down the 2v2 against uh, Blind Trust. As you can see here, this is what the stage looked like from the audience perspective. We had a bleacher set up, which mm -hmm. was way nicer and easier than last year where we had this giant quake church uh, stage with pillars and there was all the same size seats it was mm -hmm. just kind of hard to to get into it and see from every angle but now we even split up look at that red and blue for mm -hmm. the colors yeah, Ooh, girl child great. yeah easy i just love this picture of tim and by the way <laughs> tim doesn't get enough credit for being like the sweetest dude on absolute earth and probably other planets that we haven't discovered yet because like if you meet this guy uh i mean working with him is always a pleasure but even mm -hmm. if you meet him at QuakeCon, doesn't matter who you are, where you come from. This guy will sit there, talk to you, geek out with you, hug you, take a picture, probably put on Instagram because his Instagram game is so tight. That's really good. If you are not following Tim on Instagram and yeah. you have an Instagram account, you are not using Instagram correctly. Yeah, welcome to the journey. Yeah. Follow this dude. His stories He's are amazing. amazing. He's an amazing He's great. Dude. So shout out to Tim. And also the picture is just bliss. Look at that. 
And of course, he probably took that. And it's on it's such a, it's such a, it's such a like, like pickception too. He's taking a picture of a, of a screen, picture. yeah, of a picture, yeah. and someone took a picture of it. And someone's in there probably like Instagramming that, and it just goes on and on forever. So here is uh, again the last match between Blind Trust, Tox, and Claws. Shout outs to them against Team Liquid. They had Moon, a nice little series there. Moonfire Mid Year is like he waved at me in the BYOC check in line. See? Didn't want to bug myself. Yeah, he'll do that. But he'll just you go. stop and next talk time Moonfire would be like. Yo, Tim, come over here. I want a hug. Yeah. Guarantee He'll give you a hug. Oh. 100% hug. And it'll Tim be one of the best you. you've had. There's Claws and Talks looking focused. focused. I love how... So we had the face cams uh, for this tournament, which is really fun because you actually see who the hell you're looking at when yeah. you're on stream. But the funniest thing about that is is Claws plays so close yeah. to the screen, his face cam is like permanent Blair Witch mm -hmm. like the entire time, which I love because it's just like... I love seeing you know people be like... You're looking at for them. Like if you watch the Twitch stream yeah. at that time, it was like extreme close-up. Or like, <laughs> I want to get into his pores. Like, let me see like... <laughs> let me see Claws' thoughts. <laughs> Show me what the aim looks like from the inside. It's so good. I love Toxus because his monitor is so high up, you can only see his eyes <laughs> oh, over yeah. the top. Yeah. Like, <laughs> like, what's that the guy that's in Home Improvement where he's over oh, the fence? Yeah, yeah. Oh, yeah. Uh, like Wilson. The, Wilson. Wilson, yeah. the Wilson. neighbor. Yeah, yeah exactly. Oh, that was my noise. So there, there they are holding up the pummel because they want it, and it's dope. And I think I heard the end of that conversation of, well, where does that go? And Shane was just like, uh, Rafa was just like, well, oh. obviously, I'm, I'm going to be taking oh, that. Oh, he's so, obviously. You yeah. know what's funny is I didn't hear that, but I heard Tim say, like, we haven't figured that out yet. Like, yeah, that's it's, what it's, I said. Yeah. Rafa was like, no, we So didn't. I guess, I, yeah, I guess, I guess that's decided now. It's like, now. you take the money, I'll take, I'll take the glory. Just give me that trophy. <laughs> just give me that sweet, sweet trophy. There we go. There you go. That's now what, he's happy. That's what a smile looks like. Probably because they just decided, all right, I'm taking this. I don't care about the money. <laughs> and then Tim's doing the numbers right there. Do you, I feel like this is there, by the way. If they had an anime pose, like, this is it, right? Because he's doing, like, the shaking, like, the glasses, mm -hmm. dude. And then Shane's, like, got his ability, which apparently is just a gauntlet yeah. to, like, come out of nowhere. Yeah, the hang so, is just, like, calculated. Yeah, Team Liquid <laughs> anime poses when, oh, sorry, we already did it. It's right there. And look at these guys smiling. Because our boy Jahar, mm. who held it down, by the way, uh, shout out to him and Zoot and Twitch, mm -hmm. who are part of the Quake Open League, which, by the way, the signups are right now for Season 4. Maggie? Who isn't here? No. Season four? <laughs> I need verification. Season, season four, four for Open League. Open League. It's season four, right? We're, we're coming on to season five. Yeah, season five. Like five, I said, yeah. season Numbers five. Uh, if you haven't signed up already, sign up. They have different skills, different tiers, different brackets. Everything, though, comes down to just quality production, quality dudes. Of course, we've also got ESL, Go4, and Battlefy. If you're mm -hmm. just coming into the game, you can find these on Quake.com uh, if you go to the eSports section, and you can sign up for any of these. They're free. They're easy. You can win stuff like in-game prizes and monies, yeah. cash monies. And it's, it's great because, you know, we have different brackets for all skill levels. Yeah. So if you're brand new to Quake or, you know, you want to try out your metal a little bit, yeah. go in and play. It's actually not a bad thing to jump in and get some of that experience, too, because that'll just help your game overall. Yeah. Sparty is right. Claus is everywhere, and he does see all. He's aimbotting this, this whole entire thing right now. <laughs> He's aiming. So there, there's, I just wanted to show everybody, too, if you weren't there, the audience was really cool how they had the bleachers. Again, they split it up into red and blue, even mm -hmm. though, you know, it's not like you were just, you know, rooting for X team or Y team. It's really just like you wanted to grab a seat wherever yeah. you could and keep the lanes. They did have, the, they did have the, uh, the pick your pony again this year they where did. they were coming okay. up and doing like the, uh, the raffle tickets, like yeah. red or blue. Yeah, that was cool. So anyway, it was just part of that setup. It was really funny at one point. Um, Rafa didn't realize which side Hang was on during his duel, so he picked the wrong color. <laughs> oh. So we were all just good. Well, you know what's funny? I can't blame him because I was asking about it too, and, and, and sometimes they didn't even know. They were just yeah. like, I oh, don't know, pick one. They're like, what like, color do you like? I'm I was like, like, I, was like I like, yeah. I'm like, what's your favorite color? Damn it. All right, Damn here we it. go. It is blue. <laughs> it is, though. And then here, just shout out to. Uh, to our collegiate boys. So mm -hmm. Chain was actually in on the, I don't think he made top eight, but he was top 16 and his teammate for uh, for the CSL, which concluded, I think they, they played like a best of seven versus uh, Pithy and his bud. Mm -hmm. But that's kind of the fun thing too, is both Chain and Pithy are kind of like NA standard players. Like mm -hmm. they're always in, you know, all the different discords they're always playing. But that was the cool thing is they both grabbed you know, guys from their colleges who really hadn't played an arena FPS and hadn't played even sometimes a lot of FPS, and they're like, we're doing this. Yeah. We're going all the way. So shout out to Chain and his teammate yeah. for uh, for taking that yeah. down and winning. And those those CSL matches were pretty good. No, they were actually really well. It was yeah. really well done, yeah. Yeah, because yeah. both Pithy and Chain are really, they're top players. Mm -hmm. uh, just just look at that. Just look at that pummel. Just, mm -hmm. there's probably like 100 more shots of that. Please enjoy. Please enjoy. Um, okay, this is a precious moment. It's, so it's we've so got sweet. claws here giving Kaplan a hug, and look at that face. 
even Tim is like, you know what? That was a GG, <laughs> and, I, and I didn't win the 25K, but I got to kind of be happy about this. Because yeah. he was... So Kaplan was practicing with Claws. That's, right. the, that's the story behind this, if you didn't see. And uh, he was helping out his game a little bit. And like he was, he was, so, he was, he was, he was so. <laughs> <laughs> just kidding. Go on, sorry. He was, he was uh, so ecstatic yeah. that he won that one v one showdown, which was winner take all, twenty five thousand dollars right. and the gauntlet. That's and he right. was just like, hug. It was, it was, it yeah, was cute. It was, it was a precious moment. This is a quick precious moment. Again, the look at that gauntlet. Have you seen you the gauntlet? You just can't way, see enough of it. I mean, yeah. yeah, I can't get enough of that thing. The, the, my favorite thing about it was like. You know, we've done trophies before, which sometimes look like, uh, you know, like the, the typical, like, you know, cup, and it's either, you know, silver or bronze, whatever the hell it is, or gold. And we've even done ones that are like, okay, you could do like a glass one, and it's a logo, and it's like, oh, that's a cool keepsake. But when you get a weapon from in the game, yeah. not only do you know how to pose with it, because you just yeah. pick the damn thing up, and you're like, weapon. Yeah. But it's also like, that's a one-to-one -one thing that has never and existed. It's, it's not on a base. It is the base. You, exactly. you, 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 you put it on your arm. Yeah, it's like, how do, you, how do you present that? You just stand it up. You just let it do its own work. Also, someone was asking real quick. Uh, they were saying that these pictures are too good and like we have to put them up somewhere. Yeah. We are. We'll put them up on our Facebook page. Yeah. So if you are not following us there um, or, it, or Twitter or anywhere, uh, we're just slash quake on all of those things. So Instagram slash quake. Uh, Facebook.com slash Quake and Twitter.com slash Quake. Yeah, they'll all be there because Twitter will only let you do like four. So deal with it. Go to Facebook. Enjoy it. <laughs> yeah. The whole, the, way, the whole album will be up on, on Facebook. And we've got a ton more pictures than just this, too. Yeah. And these are huge shout outs to our Quake kind of photographer, Fred, for, uh, Fred Camera. Fred Camera. The guy's the man. Um, amazing. Again, just wanted to show you what it looks like while you're there. Last matchup. Uh, for, or actually, this is before the last. No, this is. The this last was the last matchup. Yeah, oh, sorry. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Red to hang the name wrong for a second. And uh, again, shout out to Claus because he did some uh, some push forward tactics that I don't think to hang was ready for, even though to hang is absolutely top tier. Uh, again, just angles, just showing you stage, <laughs> just showing you pummel. It's really all about the pummel. Look at this happy guy. Look at this guy. <laughs> That's what you do when you win the pummel. You hold it up and you smile. He's doing it. I'm doing it, mom. I mean, just more victory pose. Just yeah. making the V. Just doing it. Kaplan it's, just and it's it's you know it's it's, it's really cool. I mean, it's not. <laughs> I'm it's not, not sure what the shirt says exactly. Know. Yeah, I've been wondering that. It all looks weekend. and this. It's funny because it was it was a it was a uh, like the clothing was a part of the tag that was coming off, but it really looks like somebody photoshopped that in. Yeah. But that is actually part of the. Clothing. No, he was actually wearing it. It was like a little flag on his arm. Yeah, pretty sweet. And obviously, you know, this is this is Claus's second QuakeCon win, but it, I, I, I just yeah. gotta say, like. It is so cool to see a young guy win at a, at a Quake tournament. We have so many like great players. Everybody played phenomenally, played their hearts out. Oh, yeah. Um, and you know they've been in the scene for for quite a while. Most of our players, but you know Claws being like very young. Oh yeah. Uh, all the two D two Z guys like erupting on the scene it, from it was, last year and yeah. then comes all the way back to win the dual showdown again is really impressive. Yeah. Just. This is a picture I was taking of the two guys that did the model for the pummel mm -hmm. in the background. But this is just like, I just wanted he, raw Like I, I can't yeah. believe it. Yeah. Awesome. This is just the weight. This I happened. just did that thing. Yeah. Hold on, I just won 25K, and I just knocked everybody out of this for winner-takes-all duel. Pretty beautiful. Again, smiley face, check, pummel, good to go. All right, I, started to, I wanted to get some silly-ass ones of all of our boys here. So, of course, we've got P&D Ketchup on the left. We got Machiavelli uh, to his right. We got freaking Jahar just looking like he's already doing the scale bearer, basically. And then Stoic Zoot being taller than anyone in existence. And I think that's Kaplan's arm. Yeah, it's got to be. That's Kaplan's arm pointing to it. But this is Machiavelli trying to go like, hey, remember that that rocket jump <laughs> thing that, did? That, that you did? Yeah, yeah. I was like, that's, that's actually, I think you should have done it. You did it better. Who did it better, Machiavelli or me? Machiavelli. <laughs> that's, the next, that's, that's, the, that's the next yeah. quake question of the day. That's right. Who did it better? Who wore it better? I love this. Good, 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 good. Got the eyebrow up. Uh -huh. He's ready. Jahar is always ready. And then classic scale, scale bear. Scale bear pose. Yeah. Yep. Yeah. This is this squatting catch up. <laughs> like I cannot get enough of the squat boy. This is so tight. Like, print it and frame it. Look at these happy faces. These dudes just did an amazing job. Two full days, and some of them even three because they were helping out for the uh, community thing, of of just quality casting, just bringing us all all the quake play by plays, the flavor, the color, the analysis. Hands in. 
Hands up. We'll try it again. There we go. Ooh. Hands up. With some of them, I was like, how have you never put your hands in and done a thing? Like, I know we all don't, like, we're not like a football team, but Jesus, let's get it together. But we did. Yeah, we're nerds. We're not, uh, yeah. we're not sports ball players. <laughs> I was like, here. come on, guys. And then they go up. They're like, wait, halfway? I'm like, oh, I mean, geez. at least we didn't ask them to high five. That's true. Yeah. So this is shout out to everybody Kaplan, Zoot, Jahar, Machiavelli, and Ketchup for a great Quake Con. So now we wanted to go over some of this stuff a little bit. You want to yeah. walk us through this, Andre? Sure. So, uh, Recently, we released our roadmap, and if you are brand new to the game and you might not have seen this already, uh, here are all of our plans for what you can expect coming to Quake Champions uh, for the year and actually into the beginning of next year, 2019. So we've got a lot of the stuff from summer is actually already out. We released this stuff on August 2nd, just before QuakeCon. So we got the new champion, that's Death Knight. Uh, we added custom bot matches. You can, um, if you are a free-to-play player or, you know, if you are a Champions Pack owner and you've got some free-to-play friends coming in, you're like, hey, I want to show you this game um, and you want to play a team deathmatch against bots or you can just queue solo for it. Uh, you can play against bots. It's low stakes. You can figure out the mechanics of the game. You can figure mm -hmm. out the mechanics of the champions and the maps uh, and all that good stuff. Uh, we had some matchmaking improvements. We actually reset the MMR. Um, yeah. You know, those aren't the, the end all to those matchmaking improvements. We yeah. constantly update and um, make changes to make matchmaking quicker, uh, faster, and better. Um, and we actually removed. What? I was reading chat. Continue. Okay. I thought you were laughing at what I said. No, no, no. Okay. Um, People doing funny <laughs> shout outs. I didn't even say your name. <laughs> <laughs> Patrick. Um, so yeah, all that good stuff is coming. Um, what's coming up for the fall? We got another brand new champion coming up. We got a new map. We have new modes. This actually says, let me get in closer. Thank here. you, Klaus. This actually says we have two brand new modes. That's not technically correct. Yeah. We actually have four brand new modes Some coming out. We'll talk, about, uh, we'll talk about. We'll talk about. Yeah, we got a PAX thing going on. A, I think. I think we PAX haven't really is, talked about it because we haven't had the announce stuff, yet. Yeah, yeah. 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 All but comes out next but week. I think we can tell players that if you are going to be in the Seattle area, yeah, uh, we will be having a community meet and greet and a two day event um, at PAX. We're not quite ready to share all the details yet. Yeah. Um, as to venue and uh, times and stuff. But it will be it will be that weekend of PAX, which is the uh, Labor Day weekend, um, and we will have some really cool stuff to show off there. Matter of fact, I, I was I was very much like, oh, I can't wait to show this stuff off. Yeah, I'm, I'm so excited. Um, yeah, we'll be doing a stream from there. So we'll be doing a stream. Yeah. Yeah. And um, we'll be, uh, John Hill will be there. Yeah. Um, Andrew Dutra, Dutra, who who ever seen I don't him. think I, yeah nobody's ever seen him, but um, he is, is he a, the is he real. Yeah, he who is, is he is the workhorse who does like so much stuff as producer. Oh, yeah. I mean, getting the getting the builds in and just like keeping everything from falling apart. He is the glue yeah. that that is basically holding holding everything together. Um, yeah, so lots of new stuff mm -hmm. coming in the fall and then winter. You can expect another ch new champion, two more new modes, another map, more balance changes, more optimizations, all that great stuff, and. This is all news to people who have like been following along. Sure. Um, but what might not be news to everybody is we have something new to show off, and I'm super excited about this. I mean, I went ballistic nuts yeah. when I saw this, and I'm, I'm sure Frothy can. Oh God! Yeah, because so this is your first I'm, time seeing it today, this is, this is, right? This is my first time. This is right in my wheelhouse. Right. I'm super ready. You guys ready in chat? So finally, we Sonic might, 64 says, we might finally. Just have something you guys have never seen that will be coming to PTS soon, but I think some of you might recognize this yeah, yeah. from let's, uh, let's, let's roll the tape. from the past. Let's, roll let's the just tape. see what this is. What is this? Should I hit play? What do you think, chat? Should we hit play? Or? Uh, I mean, there, there's a big... Chasmatics is like, I'm Share ready. button up on the top. There's do a sink area. Don't show it. Yo, sorry. <laughs> <laughs> try, <laughs> wait, 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 everybody, stop. <laughs> Are they ready, sink? Should we show it? <laughs> Jeez, I don't know. Oh, okay. Oh, press the button. <laughs> I've seen a lot of press the button. Don't play it. Oh, God, I hit play. It was an accident. I slipped. Oh, my glob. I Look at this. I can't believe how beautiful this came out. Yeah. 
this is one of those maps when people talk about it so fondly, I'm like, yeah, but, you know, in Quake Champions with the space, with the abilities, mm -hmm. how is it? And then you play it and you're like, oh, Shiza, mm -hmm. this is so much better than it even was before because it adds, again, all the depth, all the speed, all the craziness. Let's so, roll it one more time. That yeah, was too me, quick. Let me go ahead. Let me see something. I think there's that a way to... That was too quick. Uh, let me do this. Let's just go ahead and keep playing it. Yeah, that's fine. It's manual. That's just going to be the rest of the stream for the next 30 yeah. minutes. Just just repeat it for Welcome 30 minutes. Welcome to the longest yard stream. Yeah. Because here we are in the longest yard. I mean, once you see that that champions. jump pad, yeah. you already know what it is. You're yeah. just like, yes. You see that middle jump pad and you're like, I know what to do. Those ramps are a brand new effect too. I love yep. those. Those yeah. are so cool. Yeah, those are really tight. Oh, it's so, so good. Sick. My favorite map. I don't think we've seen it enough. Hold on. Is that One 27 seconds? Let's go ahead and run that. I wish you'd pause that? real quick, too, because I want to talk about something. Oh, uh, not yet. Not oh. yet. I'll pause it. I'll pause it. I'll pause it. You do the pause. I don't know. I, I, I don't think Sinker will mind me talking about this, but... We'll see. <laughs> see that black hole right there? Oh, yeah, yeah. What it, chat, what does that remind you of? Oh. Yeah. That, what does that remind you of? I want to play it again. I'm just going to let it go and play. So that explains... Yep. The art style. Tag does, the does stuff. Got he got it. Nike camping. Got it. The ca what a great name. The Camping Grounds. They got it. Yeah. yeah. So that is, <laughs> if you look in church, you see the black hole that's in the in the skybox. Mm -hmm. So like that is the, the terminus yeah. where that ends. If you were to go through the, uh, the church of Azathoth like skybox, that's where you end up, is in the longest yard. Yeah. And that is just the coolest thing, because you are flying over this black hole that leads to another another Volker map. Yeah, a lot of good answers in there, a lot of DM-17s, and then a lot of spicy internet answers. So mm -hmm. keep it spicy, but remember, safe for work. There's, uh, there's children here. <laughs> keep it in your chat. Keep it in your chat. Keep it in your keyboard. We got, we got, the, we got the lore going on <laughs> right there, right? Like, yeah. like it's the Quake universe, or multiverse. Yeah. All the Quake realms. And this is one of those maps that honestly, there's so many different modes for this that are, are, are fun and different. Like playing Instagive on this with all these jump pads is just madness because mm -hmm. you're never safe. There's nowhere to hide. I can't wait to play CPM on this map. Yeah. Oh my God. Yeah. yeah. Ready. Yeah. Get your anarchies just mm -hmm. flying around the corners. Mm -hmm. Yeah. It's good times. It's good I can't, time. I cannot wait to just, <laughs> the first time, the first time I jump into this map. Yeah. I just cannot wait to knock somebody off that platform. Oh, yeah. That oh, was, yeah. I mean, flying across on that that jump pad and just like hitting someone with a perfect rocket yeah. and just watching them go, no. Oh, it's the best. <laughs> best one, feeling in one, the world. And one last time, in case you didn't get your clip together, <laughs> we'll give you the 10th time to, to figure it out. Hey, man, I'll be keeping track. No, this is good. This is good. We have a quota. Yeah, you told me 10 times. <laughs> We're doing yeah. it 10 times. <laughs> You just can't stop. I had one job. That's right. So yeah, this is coming to next PTS. We'll have a, a date on that soon. And, and we'll which have is very soon, right? Yeah, it mm -hmm. is. It, it might even be as soon as uh, 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 next week, but we'll see. We'll things see. can move, things yeah. can change. So, but, yeah, but, so but sooner but rather than later. So it. you will be able to check out this map yeah. on PTS. And we'll have more exact up. numbers for all that stuff at um, yeah. at PAX as far as And that's just a little open. bit. Yeah, what we've piece. got coming. It's just a piece of that. <laughs> so I think we're going to do what we always do here yeah. and jump into some games. Frothy's in the hot seat, yeah, which is really seat. cool. Yeah. Hold on. First of all, what in the world are we looking at here? Who's that boy? Oh, my God. That's, that's that Oni skin with Oof. the Scale Bearer edition. Oof. Available for just now, yeah? Damn. That is so... Yeah, how do you get that? So... Where is it? Is it everywhere or is it only GameStop? It's, it's it, I think game in stop. the U.S. It's only GameStop. Yeah. It's only yeah. GameStop. Yeah. So yeah. if you if you are um, outside uh, North America, you can actually go to Quake.com, mm -hmm. uh, check out the news article on mm -hmm. it. Uh, we actually have listed all of the retailers, so you can find where it is, so you can pick this up yourself. Yeah. Nobody forgot the free caps. We're getting there in two seconds. I don't have Oni caps, however, no. we do have the classic black and white, just class. Yeah. Quick mm -hmm. champions, quick logo, quick champions, quick logo, and so on. Yeah. Caps to give away. We're gonna By the way, if you were if you were here on our last stream that was before QuakeCon, mm -hmm. we're gonna send out your hats yeah. uh, with this shipment. Yeah. Sorry for the delay, folks, but we had Quake a QuakeCon. We had a QuakeCon yeah. that yeah. happened, 
and none of us were in the office to send out these hats. Yeah, so don't worry, you're not forgotten. Yeah. Uh, you're gonna, they're all going to go out at once. We, we still have your whispers, and to everybody who wins something today, just remember to send us a whisper. We need your name, your address, your email, and your phone number, especially if you are in another country not in north america yeah that phone number is super important because always fedex ships stuff back to us and then yeah. we're like oh well they didn't get their they didn't get their prize because yeah, we didn't have because it couldn't go through customs yeah the hat just makes a so, world tour and comes back it's yeah really yeah. great for the hat not great for yeah people that we get we hat. get we get a nice package with a bunch of stamps on it exactly so anyways let's uh let's look at the region re real quick let's just pick one so it's easier for everybody to get in i think we're just on va here yeah. yeah yeah so everybody select virginia that wants to play along with us here Go ahead and do connect there, and then what do we want to play? What do you feel like? Ooh, I think I'm well, probably either D DM or TDM. Skill okay. is not so great for that insta give. Mm. So it's a little do, big. Yeah, let's do deathmatch and team deathmatch. Deal. Yeah. I was really, Search. really kind of um, happy to see Skill Bear get represented in the duel, though. Yeah. That was. Yeah, yeah that, that was, was really cool. I was not <laughs> expecting that at all. Yeah. I'm a big fan. Yeah, I'm he's not fan. that big in the meta for duel right now, but. Yeah. I love seeing people use him because it's like, okay, this guy, he knows he has a big hitbox. Mm -hmm. He knows the ability is only within a certain range of which there are easy escapes for like Nyx and some other champions. But this is also a mind game now where he's like, I can pick whoever I want. Yeah, it's yeah. almost like when somebody bans somebody, they're like it doesn't. Matter. I love you I love the, the off I love the off love meta picks. Yeah, those are always fun to watch. Even win or lose, yeah. it's just like, oh, they they went there with that. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. So I've seen a couple of things in chat uh, more than once. Number one is uh, anti-cheat. So when we get in game, we'll show you how to report people in game. Mm -hmm. the, the best way for everybody out there in the Quake community to help with uh, someone that you think might be suspect, uh, whether it's, you know, you feel like their aim is going past when you're dead and they're still shooting, or whether, like, their accuracy is super high, especially mm -hmm. for, like, uh, for heavy machine gun and for uh, lightning gun, report them in game and we'll show you how. And then all that stuff gets flagged in the back end. But, of course, we've already got... Um, anti-cheat measures in place, mm -hmm. but again, it's like we're all a part of this helping together So, yeah. you know, all this data is, is always good And then if you guys want if you think that's not enough and you you really are sure about somebody You can always message mortal or I on discord yeah. send us a video or if you have it for evidence send us, Now that we've got the stats page for quake That's a lot easier because you can basically just say check this person out and right. you know We're doing that stuff daily weekly monthly and of course we can't talk about who's banned or who's not banned, but if you watch that stats page in a couple of weeks, it takes a little bit to refresh when somebody's not there. They might not be there, no. so uh, don't worry, it's all happening. The other thing was somebody was talking about uh, like performance and um, and uh, like optimization stuff. Mm -hmm. Every single patch we do, those are always in there. Um, of course, as you know, we've tried all kinds of different stuff as far as how we did like frame locking, how we did netcode, how we did client side or server side, but. All that stuff is basically like patch to patch. We're trying to notate as much as we can, but some of that stuff is so deep in like engineering minutia that it's mm -hmm. it's hard to report because again, we're all not. Uh, let's see what we got in here. Oh, nice. We got acid rain and some other peeps. Mm -hmm. uh, we're all not engineers, but yeah, just always know that every single patch. And actually, this one coming up next that's going to be in PTS and then going to go live uh, has some pretty, what from what I've heard, significant um, performance increases. So yeah. look forward to that. Yeah. Now my, my question is, do we have metrics on how many times people have reported Slambert for aimbotting? <laughs> I'm sure we, we do. We I'm, sure, I'm sure we do. Let's go to the videotape. Oh, yeah, we got to find that. Yeah, Slambert's just uh, you, you were you were, you were too good for this world. Oh, going Russian for the Yeah, we're going Russian. We're going Russian, yeah. So Russian style, if, if people don't know, is usually uh, classified as having the, uh, the keyboard straight up on your lap. So you have nothing but... Uh, but real estate on the desk for your mouse and for these precise movements as you just saw with that dub barrel just delete right there uh -huh. look at that quake uh, two peacemaker rocket launcher right leave there. slam burn alone i love it <laughs> i love it there's always somebody there rest in peace lambert <laughs> poor slambert feel slambert too young hashtag feel slambert that feels slambert man we use that quake quake fan let's get on that let's trend it yeah. let's, let's break the internet with uh feel slambert i love it Oh, oh. Was close. oh, still got it. Uh, let's see here. Do, 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 do. Yeah, shout out to the German community. They've actually been doing some cool uh, community stuff recently, some tournaments mm -hmm. of which, uh, yeah, we'll try to see if we can get links to their Discord going. But in case you're not in the official Discord, it's discord.gg slash quake. And uh, you can find Mortal, myself, 
uh, Syncair, a bunch of the devs, and pretty much all the community in there. So if you ever have any questions, there's uh, there's general, there's like a feedback thing in case you guys see something in the game that um, you're not sure of or you have a question about. And that, here, while, we, while we're at this point, go ahead and hit escape real quick. Okay, so if you go to social right here, and then you click on somebody like, uh, click on one of your teammates, it doesn't matter. So go to report user, uh -huh. click on that. And then here is where you can select, you know, whether it's cheating, mm -hmm. the harassment, spamming, any of that stuff that you ever see, thank you. Mm -hmm. You can go ahead and click on that, type in your explanation of, of what you're seeing for behavior that's something that you think needs to be flagged or looked at uh, or monitored. And we will go back and look at all that stuff and make sure that we, we clean we you know we clean house here. Yeah. So all the cheaters are out of the game, all the people being salty and weird and not friendly. Right. We uh we slap the wrist to the point where we slap them right out of the game. <laughs> so And if you you know, if you see someone in, in game and you don't report them in the match, yeah. Um, you know, you wanna check out stats.quake.com and do your due diligence and yeah. say like, oh, well, that guy's LG percentage is way above what it should be. Yeah. Um, if anybody's shooting at over like 50 to 60% LG and they're yeah. getting like over 20% of their kills, like it's pretty fishy. So let yeah. us know. Let us, let us know. Um, you can either, as But again, this as also Tokyo isn't like said, a witch hunt. We're not doing like, right. this is in Salem. Yeah. So like, you yeah. know, if you I get mean, beat, sometimes you just get beat. There, there, are, there are, you know, there are exceptions. Yeah. Right? Um, and, and that's why we actually take the time to look into all of your reports. Yeah. Um, because there will be exceptions to yeah. that to that rule. Um, it's not a hard and fast rule. But in addition to pinging Tokyo or myself on Discord or Twitter, as he says, or on forums, um, you can also go to help.bethesda.net and you can send a ticket there as well. Yeah. Yeah, one blue astronaut had another question where he was just kind of complaining about... Uh, frame input stuff like I challenge you to check out the next patch and let me know what you think and yeah. if you still have issues holler at your boy yeah since I mean all the all the videos and um, you know uh, frame timing stuff that that all of you send in we look at that we we aggregate that you know it gets passed on the team sees it um, a lot of this stuff um, it are things that we're we're working on you know we're we're aware um, we're listening to to what the community is saying about these issues, yeah. uh, and we are actively working on them. Yeah, everything with uh, with uh, Death Knight or DK as I call him, um, you know, some of that stuff is obviously going to be adjusted. Uh, I'm not sure exactly. I know some people were saying, "Oh my God, the flames, yeah, <laughs> the HUD flames." Yeah. Like it I might be turned see. down. We'll see. We'll see next patch. But for sure, the balance. Uh, we're going to have some significant balance yeah. changes coming next patch, which. Uh, you know, we'll make him hopefully uh, playable in the next tournaments, yeah. which for right now is PGL in the first weekend of October. Yeah, that's oh. gonna be cool. So he should be. DK will enter the uh, the metasphere, as it were. To mm. Metasphere to be playable. Yeah, <laughs> thinking he'll be a pick, but we'll see. We'll see. What about tribal? Yeah. Right. So I heard a story about how at QuakeCon, Dewey didn't have that tribolt. So he just like, <laughs> asked someone and they were able to like somehow get it to him. So nice. he was the only one that had it. <laughs> nice. like, he was that boy with that tribolt? Yeah, that he was thing. that boy. Well, I can confirm that, that you can you can get it out of out of Reliquaries because I got it. Yeah, I got I it like got real it. recently yeah. too. Yeah. And I was like, finally. Oh, speaking of that, shout out to anybody who is salty that they haven't gotten a plasma gun yet you can actually you can buy, buy it, it for sale mm -hmm. in the store now and by the way get that sooner than later because as you know the store stuff cycles out pretty quick it will be us, so. yeah so you have one you have one week left to get yeah. that plasma gun yeah so if you haven't gotten it yet exactly and sometimes it's more for you than it is for them because obviously seeing plasma coming at you is easier to kind of see where the origin is and how to dodge it but when you're shooting it, it's a hell of a lot easier to see plasma than it is to see yeah. nails. So uh -huh. I think it helps out a lot of players, especially, uh, you know, just sort of figuring out how the spread of that weapon works. It's a, it helps a lot of people to actually see visually that those huge uh, blue balls of plasma instead of those. <laughs> just realized that as I said it. <laughs> instead of uh, just seeing those nails popping off that are kind of hard to, to pick out of all the tapestry of this game here. Ooh, look at that. Ooh, big boy on big boy. Scale bear on scale bear. Just posing. Galactic warrioring. No, that was a word. Until you said it. He paused. Well. He's typing. He's saying something spicy. <laughs> spicy comments incoming. Oh man, spicy comments. Rip spicy comments. <laughs> yeah, spicy comments also. Shout out. I know. Uh, are there more Quake 4 weapons on the way? Uh, there could be. There could be. Yeah. Um, 
That's and the fun we... thing about everything we put in here so far is mm -hmm. all the favorite stuff from all your favorite weapons from all the different Quake franchises. You'll see them just pop in every couple months and be mm -hmm. like, okay, okay, okay. So, I mean, we got the, the beauty of having Quake in 2018 and having it being an online an always online game as a service is there's nothing but updates coming now to forever. It's not this old school, hey, we put out the box version, please mod it, it's over. It's like we're basically the mods now. And so until we get to the early access point, you know, it's like just give us your feedback as you guys always are. And if you're new, if you don't know, you can always give us your feedback yep. on stuff that you love, stuff that you're missing, stuff that you want. And we'll try to see, you know, if we can get everybody's uh, requests in there. Of course, there's a pipeline and all that stuff. But we try to be as agile as possible based on what community wants, like CTF, mm -hmm. which we'll be talking oh. more about um, at the old PAX Prime and or West and or whatever it's called these days in Seattle. Ooh, nice. See, Stomper is like the most underrated ability. Yeah. You want to explain it's, that real quick? <laughs> yeah, so yeah, heavyweight is the name of the ability. And yeah, it's pretty much whenever you hit someone going uh, at a particular speed, you'll start dealing damage to them, just direct hitting. Like yeah. the base damage is 50, you hit it at 400 UPS. Faster you're going, more damage, 25 damage increments. It's like my favorite thing. Like if I could have heavyweight on Slash, oh, oh my man. god, oh, that would I would be never play another champion. Yeah, that's true. Because being able to do that movement with the ability of, yeah. okay, all you have to do is have like kind of a height advantage on somebody and bump into them yeah. and get that damage, mm -hmm. that would be nasty. It's great. So Frothy, this is a good question from you, for you from okay. GamesMan31. He says, I bought Quake Champions today. What would be a good starting champion to play? So my favorite ones to recommend are definitely Ranger. I mean, not even because he's like the starter and everyone has him, but I mean like beyond that, like it's... He is just the most fundamentally sound character within Quake. I mean, he is Quake Dad kind of for a reason. I mean, he's got he's got that medium stack, the medium speed. His ability can be used offensively, defensively, or as a utility to teleport around. Like, yeah. you can do whatever you want with that ability, and you're going to have a lot of success with it. It's a fast cooldown. Like, everything about Ranger is just good and less self-damage from rockets, too. So you can practice your rocket jumps more safely than any other champion. I mean, True. he is, like, just the, the end-all, be-all, in, in my opinion. Yeah. Um, but other ones to try like Galena I think is really good just with mm -hmm. that totem it's that 50 point heal again you can use it defensively to keep yourself alive as a utility keep your team alive or offensively to nuke somebody down like it's all it's all good easy to play champion always useful for your team even if you're not getting a lot of kills just drop those totems get your hourglasses you're useful like it's always good yeah. so I mean those are definitely my big two but Especially yeah. if you don't know the map sometimes, too, and you're just like, oh, God, I just got out of a fight, and yeah. I need help. You just pop it. Yeah, you exactly. You it to yourself, and then it's there for your teammates, and it's a defensive thing. If somebody comes around a corner and hits it, mm -hmm. well, you just helped your team again because you did damage to that champion. Yeah. I mean, right here, you're on, you're playing on Sarnath, and, and Galena is super good for area denial. So you can just put a totem outside of these slip gates, and it's just like, oh, someone ran into it. And maybe you'll help a friend coming yeah. through, running away from somebody, or you might just, like, catch somebody who yeah. wasn't paying attention. I feel like kind of the pro tip for that. Ooh, is nice. The pro tip for that is, if you're playing a map and you know that there's a uh, Galena on there, don't willy-nilly just yeah, fly through teleporters, because chances are, th there's one an easy one placed right on the other side of when you teleport. Uh, Nico is asking about, what about Gamescom? We will be at Gamescom. Oh. Yeah. Um, Tokyo and I won't be at Gamescom, no. um, but we will have we will have some some people there. Uh, keep an eye out, actually, for our uh, Nyx cosplayer. She'll be yeah, out there. Yeah, she'll be walking around. It's really rad. I think she's got stuff to give away. Um, <laughs> Are we going to see her, though? She might be ghost walking. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. That's yeah, up yeah. to her. That's her choice. Her Nyx, her choice. <laughs> <laughs> so she's going to be ghost walking and maybe not ghost walking around. So if you happen to see her, yeah. grab a pic and send it to us and tag us. Mm-hmm. I'm just gonna go to Gamescom just so I can get a picture with an empty wall. Be like, hey, I found Nick. <laughs> <Found Nyx. laughs> yeah, tag us on those too. You got it. <laughs> it's like I'm doing I'm it. Right, it. Right I'm, on it. I'm on it. It's already setting up as a draft in my, in my Twitter. All I gotta do is just hit send. Valky right. is gonna be Ready there at go. Gamescom. Awesome. Oh, nice. Yeah, Jurassic Fire is asking about uh, movement tutorials. That's something that we're yeah. we're working on and we're looking to do. But again. Right now, uh, we're doing a lot of improvements for performance, and mm -hmm. we're doing, again, like the game modes that we'll talk more about at uh, at PAX West um, is like the main focus right now. But of course, tutorial stuff, we're always trying to get more in there, and we realize that you know movement is an important one, so it's something we've been looking at and trying to trying to get in as, as quickly as we can. But uh, it's it's not any release date 
uh, that we can talk of yeah. yet. Yeah. But you in, can. In the meantime, in the YouTube.com meantime. slash Frothy Omen. Yeah. Hey, All kinds of moving get them. over there. Exactly. Yeah. What about that panel that we did? Is there is that still that like is a that thing? is happening? So yes. um, we had a one hour panel which was amazing. Mm-hmm. Frothy was there. Gzep was there. Yeah. Veo was there. Um, dropping all that knowledge on everybody. Uh, super helpful. Mm-hmm. So that was an hour long panel. It was I, more than an hour. I yeah, we went like a little long. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> we just got it stitched together because it was so the way they recorded it was in fourteen minute segments. Very digestible. Oh so, yeah. Well, <laughs> well, yes and no, because it's 14 minutes, like, um, you know, concurrently. Oh, okay. So, okay. or sequentially uh, is the right term for it. Yeah. So, had to stitch it all together. It's like when you just and mouse, now I need to go back and <laughs> cut it all up again. Mm-hmm. Nice. So, uh, we're it's trying coming. to pretty it up for all of you out there. Get all that information out to you. Hopefully, I would like to get it by next week. I'm probably going to be working on the weekend. If you are not in the uh, Quake Discord, discord discord.gg slash Quake, you know I live there doing work over the weekend. So I'm probably going to be video editing all this weekend. I'm not even like leaving my house. So I'm just going to be like, got this Quake video to do. Mm -hmm. So, but it's, it it was awesome, dude. It was, it was so cool having you up there. No, it was a lot of fun. Thank you for inviting me on, um, man. It was great. We had so many people coming up at the end too, all asking questions. Like one guy actually was like, hey, can you like watch me strafe jump and like help me like get better? I was like, dude, it's awesome. That's sick. That was really cool. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah, And a couple of things from chat. Um, Somebody asked if they didn't get if you logged in during the presentation at QuakeCon, there were the giveaway uh, items for that, which you should have gotten Monday. But if you didn't, you can holler at us. And we'll actually, in we don't have it uh, now because all the codes that we printed for people that were at QuakeCon and couldn't get it are coming back here from there. So in upcoming streams for community, we'll have those. So whether you just didn't get them and you should have, uh, mm-hmm. which you can always holler at us for that, or you just straight up didn't know about it, mm-hmm. uh, we'll be able to hand out a lot of those codes. And a lot of the streamers that were at QuakeCon that you saw on that Friday all have codes now individually, so they're going to be giving them out on their streams too for that. Yeah. Uh, there isn't any Vulcan uh, update. I saw one or two guys uh, hammering on on that. Yeah. As soon as we know more, we'll let you guys know, but there is no update for Vulcan right, right now. Um, I saw FB Nimrix ask the question again. We answered it earlier, mm. um, but there is anti-cheat in the game. Um, you know, Again, if you suspect someone of being a cheater, um, you know, check them out on uh, on stats.quake.com. Yeah. Um, you know, you can report them in game through that in game social menu. You just hit escape. You go to social. You click on their name and click mm. report, yeah. and you can type in, "I think this person is cheating because yeah. you know maybe their accuracy seems too high." And we'll look into God it. Like. But we do actually have an active uh, anti cheat running yeah. in the game. Yeah. So this is going to be our last uh, match here because we're running out of we're gonna time. Give, are we going to give away hats? We got yeah, ten we're gonna, minutes. We're, we're going to do fire like hats. the freaking you know giveaway bonanza galore. Yes. Uh, 2018 right now here. Pastor's look at look like, at Fizz. He's like I'm on the I'm on the stream. I like yeah, Fizz. Yeah, Sparty, we're looking into how the thing updates the stat page because I know some people say, oh, I just played this match and it's not there yet. Mm. Um, we're working on to see if we can get the the delay to be less. But, uh, yeah, that's just something we're, we're looking at and working on. Of course, again, as you guys see on the page, it's beta, so bear with mm-hmm. us as we go through all these things and we take your suggestions and we try to implement all this stuff as fast as we can. Uh, the question about how to get into PTS, definitely pay attention to the... Tune into the, um, the PAX West. Why do I keep forgetting the name? Or Prime or whatever it's called. In a couple it's of weeks West. here, West. Yeah, yeah. It's West. Yeah. They they changed. It they was prime. It prime. It was Prime, and yeah. then now they have like, like there's a, a million. For that. There's they, an Amazon for that. <laughs> <laughs> they they, they have a million anymore. Paxis now. Okay. So so, so none of them are just Prime. Like they are made all it sound too elevated versus all the other. Yeah, ones. and okay. you know, like like we got Pax East, we got Pax South, we got Pax Australia. Yeah. You mm-hmm. know, okay. and they're all great. Yeah. And so you, you can't have one PAX Prime. So PAX West, that's the one in Seattle. Yeah, but pay attention to that stream for not only the, uh, some modes and a bunch of other cool stuff we're going to be talking about, but for also um, for PTS in particular, we're yes. going to have a, a, a fun thing. A couple things to talk about. People are going to be interested for that yeah. of how to get in. Um, and we might even be talking about uh, uh, Champ. So maybe some oh, Champion news. Maybe. maybe. Maybe we'll see. Maybe we'll see. Yeah. We shall see. 
Oh, let's see. Will we ever be able to change our in-game name? You uh, can, right yeah. now. Yeah. CG Garius. Uh, that's, that, that's not your name, it's just what I read. Um, yeah, you can do it right now. So if you go to the store page and you scroll down, there's a rename token. Mm -hmm. So just like uh, every other game on Earth, it isn't free because it's back-end work and people have to make sure all that stuff lines up correctly. So, uh, yeah, but you can do it anytime you want. Uh, yeah. Like right now. It's also a bit of protection, too. We, you know, we've been talking about anti-cheat. Mm -hmm. um, it's one of those things, too, where... Uh, if you could change your name a constantly times. and yep. just by like slash Nick, mm. yeah. um, that would be a problem. It, it would be very hard to like, you know, track down people. Yeah, and just be like, oh, they reported this person. Now we got to go look that person up in the back end. If I'm typing in their name, uh, it might not show up exactly. Predator asks, what's the story behind Shambler icon and nameplate? Uh, Sync, I know you're there. If you feel like just diving right into that head first, the uh, which one? The Shambler. Oh, the uh, Shambler. Yeah, the yeah, Shambler. Yeah. I mean, everybody knows he is a uh, Quake One foe, quite yeah. a fearsome one. He's badass from Quake One as an enemy. Mm -hmm. He does a little uh, lightning poo above his head and <laughs> crushes you with it. And he's also enormous, and looks like a giant lunatic yeti. So uh, all these things are true, but I think Sync knows the the true meaning behind all of this. Uh, so I'll defer to him on that. Did you see? Did you see that? Did you really see uh, in the BYOC that? Um... I think they were like boyfriend and girlfriend or husband and wife couple mm -hmm. who had the sh wearable shambler head and it was oh, yeah. sitting on top of their PC. Yeah. That was, huh? It was Clover? It was yeah. Clover? Yeah. Oh, okay. Yeah, her stuff is mm -hmm. okay. awesome. Yeah, her whole cosplay was great. Yeah. Yeah. yeah big shout outs to her. And Rodden and Ash and everybody else, uh, Odie, that was oh, helping out behind the scenes oh. too. Yeah. Big shout outs to you yeah. guys at QuakeCon and just yeah. as always for everything you guys do for the community. And Rose, thank you for supplying uh, my hoodie that I wore on the oh yeah on the on the keynote sorbet the sorbet yeah it's beautiful oh, oh yeah there, there was, no, there was, there was nothing there was nothing there was nothing better I could have worn than that yeah yeah uh, somebody's asking about Duke Nukem as a champion <laughs> wrong franchise bro but I like where you no but that. you know he was at QuakeCon he was walking around with the Doom Slayer did you see him what do you mean we were we were we were doing we were doing <laughs> how, does um, that, how does that work we were we were doing uh, the signings. Mm -hmm. um, Right by the Modders Inc. Uh, booth. Yeah. And uh, Duke Nukem. The voice actor. Uh, no, the the uh, a cosplayer. Uh, a cosplayer of Duke was walking up, and he was hanging out with the Doom Slayer. <laughs> and it was just You're like, like look at these, it? look at these two legends, <laughs> like back to back, That's awesome. holding it down, yeah. fighting pig cops and demons. Yep. I got a, I got a picture of him. I got to upload that. Nice. Right. That's awesome. But yeah, uh, Duke Nukem will likely never be in this game as he uh, belongs to 3D Realm slash Gearbox, which is not part of the ZeniMax umbrella. Yes. Let's just, we got, we got to just like code overload here. You ready to just, just start yeah, let's handing just throw stuff, stuff out? out? Who wants hats? Anybody want a hat? Anybody want one of these sweet ass Quake hats? I'm going to put it right in his view here. Just perfect. Part of it? No. He's part of his HUD is the hat. I'm you actually shoot over the hat. It's fine. <laughs> He's visor, he saw right through it. Damn. So let's do hats, let's do codes. Yeah, let's do three hats. Let's do two champions packs and two chests. Let's just make it three, two, three, two, well, two, two. Well, let's let's One, two, three. let's throw out the chests and just make them champions packs. Okay, so three champions pack, three chests. Yeah, let's do it. I, wait, champion. I just said that wrong. Three champions packs and three hats. Three hats. Let's do it. Yeah. yeah, 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 yeah. Revisionist history here. Let me just delete the bot. Easy. It's done. Because you know what? <laughs> if you get if you get the champions pack, um, yep. you can. Give it to a friend if you already have it. Yeah. You can get all the champions if you don't have it. And if you do have it and you don't want to give it to a friend, you're just like, no, this is mine. I want it. Um, you will get shards for stuff. And then if you have shards, you can buy chests. Yeah, true. So. All right, let's see here. Da, 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 da. A lot of hats popping off. Someone's a code. How do I enter? You just you just yeah, hang just out to, here you and already talk. Did. You're gonna, yeah. You already did. Your lotto ticket is in. See Squeeze and Kaz in here looking for hats. <laughs> Let's see here. Rigged. <laughs> Hashtag rig. Champions pack. Code hats. Hat dad. Gimme hat. Gimme hat hat. This is the part of the stream I love the most because it's the hardest it's, to read. It's, it's always hat. so fast. This is the best. It's just like a. This is like the real FPS behind the FPS. It's trying to read chat this mm -hmm. fast and be like, I read that. I read that. I read that. I'll respond to that. Oh my god, it's popping off. All right, let's see here. So, 
Hat, 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 hat. We're getting close. I want to run that through uh, Microsoft's text to speech thing. Hat, just hat, 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 hat. Just somebody that type Patrick, be like, you, you're one. That's right. Look under your Look under your chair. <laughs> There's a hat. Look under your bucket seat. Look under your racer. <laughs> I was going to say, why you no walk? <laughs> like, Rob, what you doing? You did. He's just hanging out with the tentacle. Hats for wraps. Uh, if you're going to make... Head if you're going to make... If anybody wants to make a quake wrap, I'm just going to put this out there. I will give you a hat. Just tag us in the, the wrap and let us let us know. And it's got to be more than 40 seconds. I'm trying to think of, like, requirements now for the wrap. Uh, just surprises. You know what I mean? Just, just surprise and delight. That's what it's all about. Okay, here we go. All right. Three hats. You want to get number one? All right. Uh, first hat. Moe Mustaine. Well done. First hat. Moe Mustaine. You get a hat. That's a good name. That's a good name. I wouldn't damage that perfect hair. I'll Number two. I'm never allowed to have a hat because of it. I'm just not allowed. <laughs> that's right. Number two. <laughs> what guess? No, that's the name. What guess? You get a hat. That guess. Guess what? You get a hat. Number three. For, for, for Arthur, you want to get this one? Yeah, uh, ooh, Drakonov. Ooh, damn. Drakonov. Hat for you. There we go. Yeah. There's our hat. Get you a hat. Awesome. Congratulations, folks. So, remember, send us a whisper so whisper. that we know that you saw it, that you right. know you won something. Quit your whistle and whisper. Moe Mustaine. We had Drakonov. We had... Third one. What guess? What guess? That's yeah. right. What guess? Yeah, so send us... So those are the three hats. Yeah. And send us all your Less. information first if you can. Yeah. Um, that way I don't have to ask you... What was your information, and then that might hold it up a little bit. Exactly. Um, oh. So, name, address, email, phone number if you are outside NA, or if you're in NA just and you just want to make sure, yeah. toss that phone number in there. Yeah, exactly. Let us know. All right, Champions Packs. Champions Pack. Let's we'll do three, this. Three of them. Getting close. Put Patrick under pressure. Easy. We got one minute. <laughs> We have one minute. We got one minute left on stream. Sparty has the best hat. He does wear hats pretty well. I guess, yeah. That. Sparty's always wearing a hat. Yeah. Shout out to Sparty and his hats. And just buy the stupid hat. No, you can't. But you can buy the, uh, there's a dark gray t-shirt up on NA's store with a giant black Quake logo and Quake Champions, I believe, on the back. Mm -hmm. Go buy it. It's gear.bethesda.net. If I didn't make that up, you, you tell me. So it, it's up there. You can find it. You can find it. I don't know. It's easy to find. Yeah. Tell me if there's problem with this. Alright. Uh, we'll see. Hmm. That's, that's a wild card. That's okay. We'll throw a wild card in there. So you want to do the first one, Andre? Yeah. So, Lord Narkom. Lord Narkom, what Lord up? Lord Narkom. You get a champion's pack. Congratulations, Bam. sir or ma'am. Easy. Something we've never done before. Drum roll. Virtual as it were. Or physical as it may be. Uh, Francesco G, straight from YouTube, yeah. straight from YT, <laughs> watching live on YouTube. Thank you for being here. Uh, how did you find us? How did you do this? We're going to get you a Champions <laughs> Pack somehow. Please whisper at us. Is that a thing on YouTube? I don't know. So help us out. So if, if no, it, wait, maybe. So <laughs> what's what will probably be easier yeah. is, honestly, uh, Francesco, just send Tokyo or myself a DM, DM on Discord. Yeah, That's Mortal so. Emperor or Tokyo Punch Out or Twitter if you're not on Discord. Yeah, but you should be on the Discord. Yep. You definitely yeah. should be on the Discord. Exactly. Uh, one last, last one. one, Frothy. You want to do the honor, sir? Mr. Tech. Ooh. Yeah. Mr. Tech. The Mr. lead speak. I like it. Yeah. It's got that three because uh -huh. three champions packs were given out. You know today. how I knew the third we're getting older is like. Uh -oh. The fact that That's not everybody can read Leet speak yeah. anymore. Oh, uh, yeah. yeah. I, I was talking to somebody in, in Discord and I was like, oh, but everybody. Can read Leet Speak, and I was like, "Oh wait, no, no, they can't no, anymore." Yeah. You're like, know what those it's are. MRT -E T3K. You're like, "No, it's Mr. Tech, yeah. and he's my boy." Uh, so Kubale, I'm on MySpace. We don't have a Quake MySpace. Oh damn, not yet, <laughs> not yet. Let's bring it back. At least, at least not that I know of. I mean, maybe Hope we can like, like the browse the depths of, like go back into the Wayback Machine. Yeah, right, and just get our MySpaces together. We can all <laughs> hang out at the at the soda shop. Anyways. Bless you all. Thank you all. We love you guys. Thank you for being here. Yep. Uh, Frothy, Frothy. Thank, thank you for coming all the way from us. the lands yeah, of the, the Frothy Mobile. And you drove all the way here yeah. from there. I just want to brand out your whole entire Absolutely. life. Yeah, get the Frothy you put on your Frothy, Frothy socks. Though, yeah. You put them on yeah. one, at a time. one at a time. Plug your stuff again, man. Where can people find <laughs> you? Yeah, yeah. So, yeah, my name is Frothy Omi. You can find me on YouTube, Twitter, and, of course, Twitch. 
streaming many days a week, mm -hmm. especially in the next couple of months. YouTube guides all about helping you improve and learn how to play Quake, get better at Quake, and just share the love yeah. of Quake. Amen. Check it out. It's the best. Check that stuff out. So thank you guys. Uh, I'll figure out somehow Sparty had to send you an American burger, but until then, we love you guys. <laughs> we'll burger. see you at PAX see West. You at PAX. Keep an eye out for that. It's going to be hype. There's going to be some stuff you're not going to want to miss, so we will mm -hmm. see you guys then. Yeah, take care, dudes. Later. See ya. <laughs>